in the at-bat prior to the time he was hit. And now he gets under it, sends it sky high into short left field. Rodriguez back from his shortstop position and he drops it. Colabello overruns second meanwhile. You see Colabello jogging around the first base bag expecting that pop up to be caught. Oh yeah, he's out. And that's just a badly missed call at second. I mean, there was nothing good about that play, which I believe will end the inning. Bad job dropping the pop up, bad job Colabello not hustling out of the box and around the infield. Bad job with the call at second, but they get it right in the end, and that'll be it for the first inning. Wow. And a one-out walk. And then Gula was wise to it, and he was right on top of the play. And now he chops one that's going to be a tough play to make. Barehanded and thrown to first, but no play. And it's a hard ground ball into left field. Up with it is Maggi, his throw to the plate. Oh, it's a slide and he's safe. Bo Maggi couldn't squeeze the one hop throw. One nothing Spain. Without a run being scored and out at home plate at that. Bo Maggi was unable to take in the throw from his brother Drew and now it's bouncing down into the left field corner and it'll be a leadoff double for Giuseppe Masanti. His 2-2 popped up towards first. Ustariz racing back, and he makes the catch. There was Oscar Angulo, the second baseman there as well, and they nearly collided. Naguera is 0-1. Is hit in the air, fairly deep to left. This one's got the height. Does it have the distance? No, it does not. What a great run and grab made by Lester Galvan. Now it's a payoff coming to Monzon, and it's down and in. Fastball high, and Bo Maggi looked like he had some trouble making the transfer into his throwing hand. Sixth place in the tournament heading into the final day. Bounces in the dirt, breaking for third. Monzon is head first slide, good enough to get him 90 feet from scoring. Infield for Italy now drawn in on the grass. And Rodriguez rolls it under the dive of Masanti. And there's the second run for Spain, a 2-0 lead. Just one out in the home half of the second. Runner goes, the throw to second. It winds up in right center field, and Rodriguez is on his way to third. Beltre popped out to short in the first inning, and now he lines one out to right field, and with one out, that'll probably bring in another run. Here's the throw towards the plate, cut off, and it's 3-0 Spain. Waits for another one, two, swings and misses, and that's strike three. Really in as fast as possible tomorrow. Now ball hit really well out to right field. Going back after it is Monson, and he backpedals onto the warning track and makes the catch. And then by the evening, it seems near certain, and Drew Maggi rips it out to left field. It's going to roll to the wall, and he'll be cruising into second with a two-out stand-up double. And a ground ball right side and into right field, a one-out base hit. Most seasons, he finished with about 10 more strikeouts than he did innings pitched. He could use one here. And he gets it. Chris Colabello leading off the fourth. Swings at the first pitch. Sends it high and deep into the night sky in Parma. And puts Italy on the board. That was a blast. And it's 3-1. You don't mess around with Chris Colabello. Not the way he's hitting at this Europe Africa Olympic qualifier. Monson, Ochoa, and Rodriguez here as he's driven one out to left field. That's a foul ball. And now 3-2 is cold strike three. Gavin Cicchini leading off against the 35-year-old left-hander who has his pitch punched out into right center field. 
between innings when they announced the score of the game in Bologna, the game taking place right now between the Czech Republic and Israel as this wild pitch will move Cicchini over to second. Look back at second. And a ground ball right side, a nice high hop, a sliding pickup, a roll and a toss to first. Nicely done, Oscar Angulo. Outfield shifted slightly the other way. And a fly ball out towards right field. This will be a test. Is it deep enough? Monson makes the catch. Here comes Cicchini, the throw, the tag, and he's safe. Three and two, here it comes. Let's the ball hang in his right arm down by his right side, now into the glove and home. And this one's cracked out to left center field, but moving over and back on it, Drew Maggi drops the ball. Already leading three to two, threatening to add a little bit more, and they may do just that. This one's headed towards the wall, and it will score Oscar Angulo. Alabello's blasts, a solo shot leading off the fourth. The biggest hit of the night, and he goes down swinging. And now Andrioli chases a pitch down in the dirt, and that'll end the top of the sixth. Fernando Martinez leading off for Spain and bouncing one up the middle. It's gloved by Cicchini, who spins and gets it to first in time. From the belt. Comes home. And that's strike three, and it's a five-pitch bottom of the sixth. Outstanding work. Only 23 as of this past June, and already he's been as high as the AAA level. Cicchini here, another triple-A guy, sends it to right, a diving effort from Monson, and he's lucky that ball didn't sneak by him. From the belt, he delivers a 3-2. You can see that pitch is outside for sure. He'll hang out over the dish again, drop it down in front of home plate, throw goes to third, they'll get the out there, and over to first, safe. Maggi rips it into left field. That's a base hit, and it could bring in a run. Here comes the throw towards the plate. It's cut off, and it's 4-3. Italy's got the tying run in scoring position with just one out in the top of the seventh. And you see him walking off towards third, being watched carefully by Alvarez ahead of the 1-2 pitch that's cut on and missed for strike three. Alvarez ready, another 0-2. A ground ball hit to short. Leo Rodriguez goes to second, and they force out Drew Maggi. After Rodriguez will roll it over to the top of the order again and see Beltre, and there's a cold third strike. Nasty stuff from Matteo Bocchi. Making his fourth plate appearance. Swings, grounds it up the middle. It takes a hop off the back side of the mound and winds up in center field. The Czech Republic still leads at 7-4. 3-1 pitch is high, and Masanti takes a walk. 1-1 pitch to Reginato is bunted. Fair, the throw goes to second, and it bounces off a glove and into short center field. Now he waits for a second, 0-2. And he swings right through it. A big strikeout for Alvarez. A look back at second. Here it comes. And Cicchini goes down swinging. On its way from Bassani. A swing and a miss. A good time for a breaking ball that Monson guessed wrong on. From the windup. Big pitch. Swung on and missed. Strike three. He did walk 168 in 247 minor league innings. And now 3-2 pitch is low, and that's ball four. Here's Chris Colabello with the game on the line. He swings at the first pitch, sends a two-hopper to short. It's bobbled, but there's time for Rodriguez. 